So when you're trying to book a ticket on this thing, right, let's just click that for argument's sake. Okay, yeah, we've got that. Yeah, know all that. Then there's nothing you can do to take it any further. Stress ball. Right, let's say we want that one. Bang. Nothing. I found out with them ticket machines, the reason you can't use them is because you need a passport to actually book the ticket. But the booking place is just there. They all speak English, very helpful. And you can get uh, the tickets in it. It was about 50 quid return to Strasbourg and you can use any, you're not governed by any uh, particular time you can get any train I was up early so I'm going to get that one there hopefully, the 7.51 I think it takes about an hour and a half right here we are, platform 30 7.51 Strasbourg the, uh, all very easy to be honest and by, by the way I bought my ticket last night the ticket office stays up until 9pm so I just thought just in case in the morning there was a queue and I did notice the return ticket you've got uh, that I can basically use until tomorrow it comes out train and with about six minutes to go there's not even a dozen people waiting to get on it quite surprised by that Here we are, Strasbourg. We got here at 9.09. It took one hour, 18 minutes from Brazil. A couple of stops, very straightforward. The train did get packed by the time we got here, but, but very easy, I must say. So I made a, made a pit stop on the way back to uh, Colmar, let's have a look here. It's uh, just coming up at 3 p.m. But I'd seen and done everything. I wanted to eat Strasbourg, to be honest. There, people say you need three or four days there. I don't know. So, uh, but I've heard this place is meant to be really beautiful. So, uh, we'll have a couple of hours here and have a look around. Just a heads up, but here in Switzerland, your normal two pin adapter that you take with you doesn't fit. For some reason, they've got a free pin one, so you need one of these with free pins in it. That goes in, but you still need your two pinner, which goes into that, and then your own phone charger goes into that, so it's actually free that you're so using I think it shows how we, uh, but what I actually done because I, I didn't know I asked them at the uh, the front desk here in the hotel and that free pin one here they've basically hired to me I had to put a 20 20 franc deposit down but they uh, I think, as far as I'm aware I'll get that back but uh, if you if you ask at the desk rather than buying one but but just bear that in mind is you, your own two pin one won't work in Switzerland